My major is business with a focus in marketing. I am double majoring in psychology and criminology. I'm a communication major with a minor in music. Of the five classes that I am taking this semester, um, one of them is a take home, so nothing too serious about it. It's open book basically, and then my other four are accumulative. Most of my finals are just papers that I have to write. I do have one in class test that is cumulative, so it's everything that we've learned since the beginning of the semester. I would say that the class that would be the most time consuming to study for would be my Management 360 class, which is the Operations Management, just because there is a lot that goes into that um, class, and there's a lot of little things that you have to know. Well, I would say the one thing that I'm doing to prepare for finals week is like spreading out my time for um, studying so that I'm not cramming or just like studying for multiple things at one time. What I do is I just go over all of my notes that I've taken from the first day of classes to what we are currently learning in class and that just kind of helps me, gives me a rundown of what all we went over and kind of pressures my mind a little bit. If the professor gives us a study guide or something to go off of to prepare for the exam, that's also something that I will definitely use. I would say that the hardest final for me to take would be my Spanish class, just because it's a different language and it's going to be a cumulative, so it's going to be everything I learned from the beginning of the year until the end of the semester. German's going to be difficult because, again, like Taryn said, it's cumulative. So taking everything that we have learned from the beginning of the semester to the end and being tested over it, it's a lot of information to study. And then um, for lit class, that one's going to be difficult because uh, given all the different literature that we have read, remembering what characters are in which play and uh, what their role was, it's just it's going to be difficult memorizing what happened when. I would say it's easiest for me to study anywhere that it's quiet. Probably the library would be the easiest, just because if I try and study in my room, even if it's quiet, my roommates are usually not studying at the same time as me, so I'll probably get distracted by them and end up getting off track. My hardest exam would most likely be my Management 360 class, which is Operations Management, because there's a lot of little things that you have to remember that play into a bigger part of the subject that we're on. Even though it is not cumulative, I know how the tests are set up, and I still think it's going to be difficult. The most stressful final that I'm gonna end up taking will be my German, and there's just so much information that we're gonna to need to study for and look back over. During, during finals week, just because most of the time, I have somebody in the class that I know that I can study with, so getting like somebody else's ideas and actually talking out loud about it with a different person other than like thinking about it by yourself, it's nice to have other people's ideas when you're studying. It honestly just depends on the kind of test that I'm preparing for. Last year, I had more of a workload, so there's more to prepare for, whereas this year, it's more complicated or more difficult to study for, so it brings more stress on me. I think this year I'm definitely gonna be able to handle the stress of finals week just because it's gonna be more laid back. I just have a lot of like take home tests and like papers to write. I know definitely in the past, like freshman year, it was a lot more stressful during finals week just because I didn't really know what to expect. Some of the ways that I would cope with the stress of finals is making sure that I spread out my studying time so that I have like a separate day for each test and it's spread out throughout that day so I'm not just being stressed the entire, the entire like, three hours maybe that I would be studying. I'll take breaks. It can get frustrating sitting down for a long period of time trying to study something or get something down. So what I do is I tend to take a step back, get up, walk around, take a break, and then come back with a whole different view on what I'm doing, what I'm trying to accomplish. One of the best ways that I cope with um, the stress during finals week is planning out my day like hourly because I get 
really distracted easily. Planning out the rest of my day and having it like laid out for me already helps me to get done the work that I need to get done. What was the question? Do you handle stress well? So say like No! Just What was the question? <laughs> what was the question? Thank you. Next.